Today, we're going to look at some English grammar. It's going to be the present continuous tense, or some call it the present um, progressive tense. The book I'm going to use, it's in the description below. It's called Essential Grammar in Use, if you want to get it and work along with me. So the present progressive tense is something that, or the present continuous tense is something that you do at the moment. You can say, at the moment, I'm watching a movie. Um, right now, I am eating a hot dog. I'm not. Um, okay, so here we've got some examples. It says here, she's eating. She isn't reading. So she's eating. And if you want to create a negative, she isn't reading. Um, it's raining. It is raining. It's raining. The sun isn't shining. They are running. They're running. Or you can say they aren't walking. <laughs> there they say we're running. Okay. So here we go. The present continuous is am, is, or are, plus doing, eating, running. If it's a, a short form, a short verb like that, uh, then you get an extra n. Running, writing. I'm not. I'm working, I'm not working. Chris is writing a letter. She, so if it's I, it's I am plus ing. If it's only one, he, she, it is plus ing. And if it's uh, plural, if it's many, you, we, you, they are plus ing. Chris is writing a letter. She isn't eating, or you can say she's not eating. Both are fine. The phone is ringing. We're having dinner. You're not listening to me, or you aren't listening to me. The children are doing their homework. So here we can see am, is, are, plus ing. Something is happening now. I'm working. She's wearing a hat. They're playing football. I'm not watching television. Okay, so here we can see it's in the past. It's right now. It's in the future. Please be quiet. I'm working. I'm working now. You can say now I'm working or you can um, put the time word. Uh, you can put the time word at the start or at the end. Now I'm working. I'm working now. Look at Sue. She's wearing her new hat. She is wearing it right now. The weather is nice at the moment. It's not raining. Once again, you can take the time word and you can place it at the start. At the moment, the weather is nice. The weather is nice at the moment. It's not raining. Or what's the other one? It isn't raining. Where are the children? They're playing in the park. You're on the phone. We're having dinner right now. We're having dinner now. Can you phone again later? You can turn off the television. I'm not watching it. Okay, so here we've got where you can change the verb into the present continuous tense with the ing. Come, coming. So it ends in an e and it just, um, it falls away and it becomes, you add the ing. Write, writing. Dance, dancing. Now, if you've got a short um, word like this, a short verb like this, you can say run, running, sit, sitting, swim, swimming. And then here, if you've got a L, I, E, then it's going to change to a Y, lying. Okay, so here we've got some examples. So we're going to do these activities together. What are these people doing? Um, so we can see she is eating an apple. Let me just move it up a tiny bit so we can see. Ah, no, only a tiny bit. Okay, it doesn't like me very much. Okay, <laughs> we'll just go with it. Number two, he is waiting for a bus because it's singular. It's only one person. They are playing football. They are playing football. He is lying on the floor. They are eating breakfast. She is sitting on the table. Complete the sentences. Use one of the verbs. Please be quiet. I'm working. Where's John? He's in the kitchen. He is cooking. You can say he is busy cooking. Uh, you are standing on my foot. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Look, somebody is swimming in the river. We are on holiday. We are staying at the Central Hotel. Where's Anne? She's, where is it? <laughs> Not swimming. <laughs> she's having a shower. You can also say she's taking a shower, but uh, we've only got have here. Uh, 
They are going to a new theater in the center, city center at the moment. They are going to. I am going now. Wait, I'm missing. Oh, they are building. Sorry, guys, I messed this up. They are building a new theater in the city center. I am leaving now. Goodbye. Okay, look at the picture, write sentences about Jane. You can use she is plus ing or she isn't plus ing. Jane isn't having dinner. She's watching TV. She is watching TV. She is sitting on the floor. She isn't reading a book. She isn't playing the piano. She is laughing. She is wearing a hat. She isn't writing a letter. Okay, now what's happening at the moment? Write true sentences. Okay, I'm not washing my hair. I'm not washing my hair right now. Uh, it's snowing or it isn't snowing. It's not snowing. It isn't snowing. I am not sitting on a chair. I'm sitting on the floor. I'm, I'm not eating. It isn't raining. Wait. Actually, it might be raining. <laughs> it is raining at the moment. I am learning English. I'm not listening to music. The sun isn't shining. It's quite late right now. It's, uh, it's evening. I, <laughs> I'm not wearing shoes. I'm not reading a newspaper. Okay, and we'll continue here where we've got present continuous Questions, are you doing? Now, this is important because you want to ask, you want to know how to ask people questions. So here is the positive and then the question. I'm doing something. He is working. She is going. We are staying. Then if you want to make a question, you just take this, the is, am, or are, and you place it at the front. So that will make a yes or no question. Am I doing? Is he working? Is she going? Are we staying? Are you feeling okay? Yes, I'm fine, thank you. Is it raining? Yes, remember to take an umbrella. What's Paul doing? By the way, Paul is my younger brother's name. Uh, what's Paul doing? He's reading the newspaper. What are the children doing? They are watching t television. Look, there's Sally. Where's she going? Who are you waiting for? Are you waiting for Sue? So these are all yes or no questions, but we can ask for more information by, uh, by adding some question words like where, who, why. So here we've got the next one. Where are they going? Where are those people going? So some short answers here. I am, I'm not. Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Or uh, no, he's not. Or no, he isn't. Both are fine. Yes, we are. No, we are not. Or no, we aren't. Are you going now? Yes, I am. Is Paul working today? Yes, he is. Is it raining? No, it is isn't. Are your friends staying at a hotel? No, they aren't. They're staying with me. Okay. So here we've got some more activities that we can do together, some exercises. Are you watching it? No, you can turn it off. Are you going now? Yes, see you tomorrow. Is it raining? No, not at the moment. Are you enjoying the film? Yes, it's very funny. Remember, don't say that the film is fun. Um, you have to say the film is funny. I know that um, many of my students make that mistake sometimes. Is that clock working? No, it's broken. Are you writing a letter? Yes, to my sister. So more, some more activities. Uh, cry, eat, go, laugh, look at, and read. What are you reading? Where is she going? She's going through the exit. What are you eating? Why are you, I guess... <laughs> That's not laughing. So why are you crying? What are they looking at? Why is he laughing? So here we've got some more. Is Paul working today? What are the children doing? Are you listening to me? Where are you? Where are your friends going? 
are your parents watching television? What is Anne cooking? Why are you looking at me? Is the bus coming? Then here we've got some answers for short ones. Are you watching TV? No, I'm not. Are you wearing a watch? Uh, no, I'm not. Are you eating something? No, I'm not. Is it raining? Yes, it is. Are you sitting on the floor? Yes, I am. Are you feeling well? Yes, I am feeling well. Like I said before, you can add some question words if you want to. Um, so what are you watching? I'm watching a movie. What are you wearing? Uh, when are you eating dinner? Um, uh, where are you going tomorrow? So you can add these words, but we'll look at it later. 